There are a few things we're looking to do in this war, namely take these three provinces, but I'd also like to get a nice humiliate off on uh, my rival over here. Why not? You know, there's no reason to not do it. Also, I was taking a look here and uh, the age of reformation, I reckon we will be able to pop a couple of these guys because we'll probably end up joining the reformation. Well, we will create a colonial empire. We probably will convert another nation. We definitely will. Unify culture, maybe that's a little tougher because the lowland cultures are kind of all over the place. Asian trade, probably not. So as far as our golden era goes, I don't really know if we should pop it now or in a couple of months. We'll see though, but I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and welcome back to SimEU4. Flavor Universalis is a beautiful mod and I have been enjoying the heck out of it and I hope you guys have as well. I'm gonna send our cannons over there. Have you guys do something like this? No, no, no. What am I doing? There we go. So these guys will siege them down. That's fine. Look at this. Brabant looking good. So here, here's the uh, the benefits of having a march. Um, so if we sort by morale here, Liege has the best morale in the world. In the world. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> they also have decent defensiveness so good stuff so yeah Munster is gonna get pieced out pretty quickly and then these guys East Frisia did we co-belligerent them I cannot recall we co-belligerented them so we're gonna vassalize them maybe AE dependent they would be a good vassal to have so let's have our heavy ships grouped up over here with our admir admiral and have these guys blockaded no funny business. All right, if these guys want to attack me in the woods, they certainly can do their best. They will be there on the 19th, and I can be there on the uh, the 20th. So they are attacking me. This is a defensive battle, mind you. <laughs> and they will get bent, as the kids say. And uh, we'll, we'll track them down here and kill them. Come on now. Right, you guys are sons of guns. Sons with guns. This calf stack is now mine. Stop right there, criminal scum. So we can get innovativeness for Diplo. Yeah, sounds good. We can also upgrade our ships. So let's do that. Upgrade our ships here. Ooh, it's expensive. Uh, we can do that. And then we'll we'll take mill early if it means we can get some innovativeness. I have no no issues with that. Let's scorch Munster. If they want to go in there, they can. Otherwise, they can uh, get bent. Okay, I guess we'll fight them over here. Because remember, we get the plus one for being in farmlands. So even if they reinforce, it's like we're we're clapping them, right? Look at that. How about that? Let's get up here. They want to fight. They can. Yeah, that's what I thought. All right. So this war's over. <laughs> that's pretty good. Let's um. Attrition for enemies, fort defense. I guess we'll just go with morale. Level two and morale advisor is fine. This level four admin advisor is clutch. Very clutch. I'm curious, has anybody taken admin nine yet? Yep. Taken last year. All right. These guys will, they'll get sorted out eventually here. I think once these guys go back to protecting trade, matter of fact, let's have you guys not hide during during war. The rest of the lights should join up with them, right? Maybe not. Doesn't look like they are actually. That's okay. I can uh, get them sorted myself. Protect trade in uh, English Channel. Let's actually do a little bit of protection in both. Why not? Por qué no los dos? Those guys are gonna get beat up on because Liege is an overpowered vassal. Our queen has, our duchess has died. She was young too. 252 is not necessarily the best, but he's only for four years. All right, I suppose. Losing that stab is no fun though. So I guess that if that's the case, we might as well just stab up then. We're gonna be, we're gonna be able to take it on time anyway, so it's no big deal. So in this war, we will take these three provinces. The AE is pretty bad, but it's probably okay. Especially considering that some of it will tick down a bit 
Yeah, like Frankfurt won't be able to join. Mines probably won't be able to, and Hessa won't likely be able to. Munster, we can separate piece for humiliate, transfer trade power, war reps, and all their money. That's pretty good. <laughs> I forgot about Savoy. Saluzo, so we can just let them get annexed by our ally. That's fine with me. That's one less tag to worry about. Now, these lads up here, I would like to vassalize them. 63 AE is a bit more than I'd like, but if you take a look here, it looks like everybody from Bremen down to Baden will not be able to join a coalition. You know, I'm thinking about it. And these guys have a truce with us till February. We'll be able to, we'll be able to get that. So I think that's the move. 17 AE. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Do it to it, friends. This will allow us to, uh, there is no diamond district, so we cannot do it, but three more dev in Antwerp and it's good. Secure the South, mm, maybe, but we need one more province here. Is East Frisia considered lowlands? Low countries, it is. Ah, right, it's being calculated in there as well. So we need one more province. All right. East Frisia is disloyal. Understandable. All right. So, yeah, the AE is pretty bad. I'm not going to act like it's not. We have a half off level three admin or er, relations, relations advisor. Let's take a look. Let's break off this alliance. We don't need you anymore. We don't need you anymore. Let's dissolve that alliance. Obviously, we want to make sure we're still building spy network on these lads. Yeah, coalition is likely going to happen. I would like to see if we can find an ally to help deter it. Brandenburg, Ragusa is pretty big. Danzig, Stetten, Brunswick, Brittany. Venice would be a good ally because they got some clay down here that we could release if uh, we do get attacked. So let's do that. I'm okay with being over my limit. Scotland and Munster are no longer valid rivals. So we'll recall those embargoes there. That also means that we need to set up a couple new rivals. France, Denmark. Sounds good. Sadly, we get the unlawful territory down here. That's okay. Let's have my, uh, my boys brought home. These guys are heavies. Those are heavies as well. All right, not bad. Some disloyal bros, but that's okay. Take the claim there. As soon as our truce is up, we're going to attack them. February. A couple of people, a couple of one, like OPMs joining my coalition means nothing to me. So let's actually keep these guys right here. This is fine. The six stack can handle them. These guys can handle those rebels. Friesland will call in who? A couple of people to break up the Dith Martian. So none, neither of those guys are in anyways. Yeah. Okay. This is fine. We're probably going to prevent the coalition from firing. We're just sitting in this war for a little bit. Colonialism is here. Now, deving it is definitely something I would like to do. We can take this tech for a little bit cheaper than base. Where would we want to dev it here? In Zealand, maybe? Holland? Definitely Holland. So let's put Holland on dev cost here. We have prosperity. We got dev cost edict. Our burgers are nice and loyal. Even after we yoink Crownland, they're still loyal. So Holland, here we go. We have the Amsterdam Dyke, which is giving us 10%. If we wanted to, we could upgrade it. Hmm. I think I'm okay with just the way it is right now. So I just need to make sure that I keep a neat enough mill mana to make sure that we are not um, we're still going to be able to take the the tech on time. So right there, that's good. And the rest will we'll continue to dev it up there. But that extra bit of manpower is good as well. Let's um, recall you for a couple 
for at least a month here. So we can declare this war as soon as they join my coalition. Very good. Um, for his claim there is fine with me. Transfer trade power relation with. That's unfortunate because they're probably going to join the coalition before I can declare the attack on them now. Please don't do it. Please don't do it. Please don't do it. The second of March. Did they join? They did not join. It's fine. I'll actually declare on behalf of East Frisia. All right. So as long as we take mil tech on the, the next yearly tech, we're good here. Very good. Very good. Not bad. A couple of peeps over here in the war. I don't particularly care about them. Let's have these guys suppressed down here. Have you guys grouped up over here? With a general, of course. Now, I would like to annex them. We'll see. I'm pretty sure I can actually... Let's give that province East Frisia. I'm pretty sure I can actually annex them and it doesn't cost me Diplo. 38 AE though, yeah. That, look at that. Two provinces. It's just like... Uh, it's just... And then I was getting people commenting saying, Why didn't you take more? It's like, bro, what... What do you want me to do? <laughs> do you understand how much AE you get in the HRE? It's nuts. It's outrageous. It's like diamonds. Outrageous. People joining our coalition still. I'm actually not too worried about it. As long as England and um, Venice were to join, I think we would be fine. Let's get some money from you. Buckets of ducats even. And uh, we'll be able to take this mill tech next year for quite cheap. So... Do a couple of those clicks there. We'll still be able to take it. No problem. All right. Very good. Not bad. We may. We very well just may form the Netherlands today. So do we have mill access? We do not. These guys hate me. So they're not going to give me mill access. I don't. See, I'm over my diplo limit. So I don't want to ask for mill access by, from anybody. Yeah, I'll royal marry you. War reps. I don't think so. We need one more province. Mill mana or army tradition, really. I mean, both are pretty good. I think I'll take that army tradition, though. Still can't convert. That's crazy. Yep, so as long as we take this on the yearly tick, we will be good. Nice. All right. And let's just siege these guys down. Easy peasy, right? Make sure you got all the cannons on there. We do not have our siege general for some reason. So let's have you guys do that and then take him out of there because that is our non-siege general. Disease outbreak, like you do. This war is... Mm, it's not super necessary, but it's more just to prevent Frisia from joining. No, I missed it by like two days. Son of a biscuit. Okay, well, that's fine then. If that's the case, we'll just spend some extra mill mana. We'll take it whenever we can. We'll embrace institution. We, If we embrace it right now, we can probably sell it to England. But um, it will spread pretty dang quick, honestly. Yeah, we're going to wait and embrace it when it's very cheap and then try to sell it to England and or Savoy and or Venice. If we integrate them for free, there's no point in taking those provinces. So these lads are going to get pieced out for all their trade power because they both have trade power and a node that I am steering from, which means that's money that I should be collecting. But yeah, we'll be able to uh, get colonialism in all of these provinces very quickly because of how much dev they are. Look how much dev we have. Like if you zoom out, you can see Flanders. Like Holland right now is at 39 dev. And I dev that up mostly myself, right? That's pretty crazy. Put you guys back on trade power, of course. Very good. Let's turn this one off the edict so we're not paying for it, of course. Get our cannons and our general up there. We're already blockading it. Very good. Oh, look at that. Mm. So good. So, so good. Our regency ends. That is fine with me. Jan will come to power. Those diplo men are nice, but it's not super... I think I'd rather have mill and admin. Being ahead on Diplo is just a bonus. As long as I'm ahead on Diplo, you know, deving is nice, but it's not required for me. We don't need to be that. I will now 
improve relations with a bunch of people over here that are not in my coalition to prevent them from joining. Let's improve relations with you. You guys are in. Lorraine is not in. They could not join. Yeah, most of these people won't even be able to join. Let's improve with like Bremen. Basically, I just want to make sure that my coalition doesn't get too out of control. Because if it fires, it's just going to be annoying more than anything. Sink their navy. Didn't steal any ships. That's fine. All right. Take that there. Let's peace out everybody in the war. Separately, of course. For all their money. And then we'll... Farm a little bit of prestige as well. And same with you guys. Farm prestige for that improved relations as well as steering money. Basically, we're just getting rich off this war. Um, that's fine. And we'll go back to improving relations with these guys. Because having high prestige is really good. Gives you improved relations. And AE impact reduction. So, just good things all around. But uh, where are we at now? Oh, yeah. Making progress. We'll wait one more year to take these techs. No reason to take them ahead of time. Plus, we'll be able to embrace institution within the next year or so anyway. So all is well. So, yeah, this war, we're basically going to have to sit and wait on it because we're not going to be able to um, piece this out. This coalition is going to be nuts. Yeah, we're not going to be able to do this. All right. We'll just take the one province then. And even then, look, we still got to wait like two years. So let's take a look at our truce map mode. Let's attack these guys. Basically, just want to make sure we stay in war. That way we do not get ganked by um, the emperor. People will join our coalition. It's fine. I'm not worried about them. This is fine, though, because what it does is it truce locks everybody around us and allows us to get uh, money from them. So this is a fort right here. I do not recall that there was an army there. All right, 261. That's okay, I guess. I don't know. I definitely could think we could do better, but that's okay. These guys we're not going to take anything from. Admin benefits or mill benefits. Go with mill. Where are we at here? So it's in our capital now. But yeah, we still want to make sure we, we want to get it at least in these provinces ghent the hog and uh antwerpen looks like we'll be able to get it here pretty pretty quick as well so all is well okay put the two siege general in there money for innovativeness uh, i think that's fine the prestige is nice as well Speaking of, can we convert yet? We can. Is there any conversions yet? So these guys converted. That's actually not super good for us because it means we're going to spawn the second center of reformation over here. Yeah, that's not that's not ideal, but can't do it while at war. Yeah, we have to wait at least one more year. That will get Verden, Strasbourg, Württemberg, Würzburg, and Hainaut out. So let's see here. We can attack these guys now. They're allied at Luxembourg. So yeah, this is fine. Let's do something like this. With a general, of course. Here we go. Okay, send you in there. You guys over there. And that war is done as well. My vassal getting sieged down over there. Side with the burgers always. Always side with the burgers. No reason not to. So these guys took that province back, which is annoying. A little bit of extra AE to assert our dominance. Let's get another general. Very good. I will convert that, send that province over to East Phrygia again. Get over here, kill off Mem again, because you guys have no right to be sieging down my vassal there. You punk. All right. So these lads here. Send me all your money. 
Once we see Jonas Capital, there we go. These guys will be good. Okay, we can embrace for pretty cheap. I think that's about as good as it's going to get for now. Let's see if you guys want to buy it. Yes, they do. For four ducats a month, I will gladly do it. Yep. All right. Coalition looks kind of gross. This province right there. Is it? Was it 20 before? I swear it was 13 before, but that's okay. Yeah, not going to happen. And I can't be bothered to micro to improve the relations with everybody. These guys will give me all your trade power, all your money, and you will break your alliance with Nevers. There we go. We're going to stay in this war as a cover war so that my vassal doesn't get unlawful territory. But first, we're waiting for the yearly tick. Oh, and we need to embrace these two techs. Very good. Upgrade our men. Offensive pips is fine with me. So the yearly tick has happened. We should be good now. Yep, a couple more peeps, but nothing I'm particularly worried about. Transfer your trade power to me and all that stuff. Also, break off your alliance with Loonberg and Dith Martian. Nice long truce. All is well. We can now form the Netherlands. Before we do that, we should probably make sure that uh, we can do this. So, yeah. Sadly, it doesn't look like we're going to be able to do that. Once we form Empire, we'll be able to get that anyway, so it's not a big deal. Okay, so this will give us innovativeness. Okay, so all we need to do is Dev Brabant. So I'm going to do that. Uh, dev, dev Cost, we're ahead of time on all three techs, so no reason to worry about that. Do we have pro pro uh, b b b Prosperity? We do. So we want to spend the least on mill mana, so we'll go there. And there we go. Five innovativeness is solid as well as, what was that? 20 papal influence? Oh, wow. We're about to lose that. Unrest guy is pretty good as well. I'm actually going to hire this guy because once we piece out uh, this war here, we're going to convert to the appropriate religion, which is Protestant, of course. That's crazy that we can, we can form the Netherlands while at war. Maybe we should just do it right now. <laughs> I don't know. Let's have you guys come up here. Peace out, Luxembourg. Again, farming prestige. Not because I need it, but it also takes it away from them, which is fine. Here we go. This siege has been going on for so long. Year and a half. Level 3 fort. Left behind a couple of cannons. Let's get a couple more cannons over there. If they get there on the siege tick, hey, very good. Nice money for pr money for uh, the stuff for uh, professionalism is good. We just wait on this core to finish up, and then we'll peace out. No big deal. Sadly, we're not getting converted by any of this stuff right now. Uh, prestige or admin mana? Yeah, I don't want to lose prestige. We want to make sure that we're keeping our relations as high as possible. Because, uh, yeah, the HRE is a mess and the, our attrition or our co coalition is not looking good. Though most of these guys are not able to join, which is good. More professionalism. Holy crap. We're getting a lot of these events. And this is like, this is like regular as well. So that's really good. Um, damn it. I'm on a list trying to get myself a 3080. You guys know how hard that is. Anybody who's, uh been following anything with the uh, graphics card market is just horrific. I hate it. So these guys are almost done. We'll get call for pizza here within the next couple of months. Core is done. We will not force religion on them. We want Protestants, so it wouldn't get rid of the, the, the thing, but uh, I'll take all of his trade power and then there you go. Very good. And um, I guess we click the button. We are now the Dutch Republic, the Netherlands, right? Did that change our government type? 
No, it did not. That, that happens via event here soon, I think. Obviously, we want to try out the new uh, traditions and ambitions. I don't know if they're different from vanilla. Nope, looks like they're vanilla. That's okay. Dev cost is good. Siege ability, fire damage, heretics, naval fire, dev cost. Merchants is nice. I'll take the merchant. Inflation reduction and uh, naval force summit trade efficiency and uh, sailors. Okay. With that extra merchant, we will... What? What will we do? We can steer from the North Sea, I suppose. And then with that, let's make sure that we can at least get a center of reformation. We can. Sadly, it's going to be right next to another center of reformation, but that's okay. We've spawned one in Brabant. And click a couple of these buttons here. And I see it's, it's one of those things. It's very tempting to take Defender of the Faith, but in this patch it is so punishing if somebody gets attacked and you don't defend them it's so punishing so i think i'd actually rather just have one one merchant or one missionary but we are the netherlands now our new mission tree is nuts <laughs> if you guys are excited to see it make sure you show your support and leave a like on the video it helps me out a ton don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and uh, ding the bell check out the discord patreon or twitter subreddit all that stuff it's all linked in the description below and uh, support me on Patreon, also linked in the description below. Patreon support's huge. It really is what allows me to do what I do. So couldn't do it without you, lads. I appreciate you all. Love you. And I hope you're all doing well. This is Chewy Shoot, and I will catch you guys later.